when you're talking about um, an addiction, it involves the pleasure centers and how you react to stimuli that bring pleasure to you and does the bar go higher and higher and higher where you have to have more and more and more. That's why when people are using heroin or cocaine or meth, a little bit is okay to start with, but then it takes more and more and more. And what has been indicated is that with gaming, they're beginning to see the same sort of high, the same sort of anxiety in withdrawal, which you're uh, experiencing when you don't have access to that, because the brain has changed. And it has to be changed back. There's great plasticity in the brain. Uh, it can change. and. I've brought an expert here today to talk about this. We're joined now uh, by James McManus, um, a licensed mental health counselor and certified addiction professional who is the founder of Family First Adolescent Services. Now, they're located in beautiful Palm Beach Gardens, Florida, and focus on providing a professional, supportive, and safe environment where families can address substance abuse, behavior, mental health concerns, and gaming addiction is one of the things that you all have had to start facing and dealing with, correct? Correct, Dr. Feld, and I think that in regards to problem gaming or addictive gaming, it's a symptom of uh, an underlying cause and condition. And what we want to do is, is help Jake and help the family deal with that pain. He needs help with this and you two need to up your game as co-parents. And what I would like for you guys to do is go back stage when we finish here and sit down with Jim and let him explain exactly what protocol they have available to help with this issue and with these neurological issues and see if we can get this on track. Yes. Make sense? Yes. Okay. All right, I want to thank my guest today and a special thank you to James McManus from Family First Adolescent Services. For more information about today's show, log on to drphil.com. Tell us what you think on Facebook and Twitter. I know this is a very hot issue because this is happening in homes across the country. And uh, Jake, thank you for having the insight and willingness to come and of talk about you, this. Dr. Phil.